Oh, favorite Taylor Swift song, Blank Space. I know every word. Favorite pro to be paired with and why? Rory. He's my teammate. Boston Common <laughs> Frogs, baby. <laughs> Last pro golfer I texted. This guy. <laughs> there you go. We were one he was wondering whether I was wearing shorts or pants today, so we coordinate coordinated with the pants. <laughs> Best shot you ever hit in a tournament. Uh, I would say the year I won the PGA, I on the 15th hole I made a triple bogey, and then I, the 16th hole is a really tough par four, and I had to I had to hit this fairway in order to win the tournament or try to win the tournament, and I hit the best drive of my life, and I can still picture it and feel it and see it, and it's kind of a boring shot in the whole green, grand scheme of things, but to me it's the mo the most well struck shot I've ever hit. Last book you read. The Alchemist. Just read that over the weekend. I'm glad I didn't pick that. <laughs> favorite meal. My favorite meal is if I can get a good pizza, like if I'm really gonna get wild here. A, a nice cheese pizza is my favorite meal. Simple but effective. Best sporting event you've attended as a fan. Ah. Uh, Probably not the, yeah, no, I would say the trilogy fight between Tyson Fury and, and Deontay Wilder for the world heavyweight title in Vegas a couple of years ago. Probably the best sporting event I've been to. Best encore snack. Um, I like to eat a ton of beef jerky uh, and I, you know, I eat a ton of it during the day. so you know, as much beef jerky as I can get. Favorite course that isn't a tour stop? Whoa. Uh, Pine Valley. If golf didn't exist, what, what would you be doing? I think about this all the time. I'm so lucky. I'm good at golf. Um, I I never had a backup plan in my life, but if I if I could choose something that I would love to do, I would love to work in in the Boston sports in some way, like work with the Patriots, the Red Sox, and be in the in the um, Boston sports sort of atmosphere. Well, if the golf doesn't work out, you can yeah. always just run the Boston Commons. <laughs> That's <laughs> perfect. <laughs> A course you haven't played but want to. Um, Cypress Point. Never played Cypress. I've been there for lunch three times, but never played the golf course. Part of your game that needs the most work. Uh, I think we're all trying to be better putters, better short game. So for me, I'm always trying to get better on the greens around the greens, because I think that's, especially majors, I think that's how you can win tournaments. Agreed. Most common mistake you see amateurs make. Uh, honestly, trying to play shots that they can't pull off. I think if most amateurs, and it's a really boring answer, but if most amateurs just played within themselves and just took on what they could and, and didn't try to do too much, I'd sort of play above their, uh, I guess their level in a way, I think they would shoot better scores than their handicaps would come weight on. Favorite golf memory with Keegan or Rory? Well, I have one of my worst memories with Rory. Um, and that's one of my best. It's one of his best. So, um, to be honest with you, we've, we've, we've been out on the tour for so long together. It's been fun getting to know Rory. This, this whole Boston Commons thing has been fun. Um, you know, playing against Rory, Tiger, Phil, like these guys is always so fun. And, um, even even in our Ryder Cups that you know we've played against, I, we love playing against the best. So for me, Ryder Cups with Rory have been my favorite. Uh, I'd say Ryder Cup, um, yeah, 2012, 2014. Um, 
I'd say being at the Grand Slam of Golf together yeah, in that Bermuda. Was cool. That's for sure. cool. That's a good, that's a I way mean, that's better a, answer. That's, that's yeah. a, I think it's the most exclusive, or was the most exclusive, exclusive club yeah. in golf for the year. It doesn't, uh, doesn't exist anymore, but I think being there and being two of the yeah. major champions in 2011 was pretty cool. That's a way better answer. I like that better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, favorite Taylor Swift song, Blank Space. I know every word. <laughs> Dream foursome. Okay. First, I let me think about this for a second. I hate this question because I, I always come up with like different answers. I do too because my dream foursome, I'd love to just play with my buddies. Yeah. You know. Well, then, then yeah. I'll, my dream foursome, if I was to go play golf, would be with my best friends. But I would love to go just threesome. I'd like to go myself, Tom Brady, and Bill Belichick. And I'd want to have a session, a therapy session, and figure everything out, work everything out, have them both come back for one more year, and win one more Super Bowl. That's funny. What's your middle name? You know what my middle name is? Daniel. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Daniel. Yeah. Didn't. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Song you've been listening to on repeat. I am so obsessed with Noah Khan right now. He's from Vermont. He grew up like 10 minutes from where I grew up. Uh, I watched him uh, at the Grammys, and I was I was filled with so much pride. I, I we we have a, we've connected, and we have so many weird connections in the Vermont world. And I'm just so proud when I see another guy from Vermont do what he's done. So Noah Khan. Duncan order. Uh, just a regular coffee black coffee yeah no nothing fancy no no like whipped cream no, and you don't seem like no, a whipped cream no, guy no i'm not lowest round in where i shot 60 at the byron nelson uh in like 2012 2013 um birdied the last three so i never really had a chance at 59 but that was um that's my lowest weirdest fan interaction um actually it was sort of your old Stomping grounds, Beth Page Black. Yeah, there's a, there'll be a lot of those. 2009 US Open, I had like the big, like bushy Afro hair, and there's this guy heckling me at the back of the tenth tee. He's like, "Get a haircut, get a haircut." And I look around, and this guy's hair is down to his shoulders. <laughs> like, dude, what are you saying? So, but yeah, Beth Page Black, get a haircut.